There are several prefects in your school and each prefect has their own roles. For example, the assembly prefect coordinates the assembly and disciplines latecomers. The sport prefect organizes and oversees the sport activities. The library prefect makes sure that the books in the library are well arranged and there is law and order in the library. Also, there are different teachers that take different subjects. Your mathematics teacher won't enter the class to teach you CRS and also your English teacher won't enter the class to teach you fine and applied arts. Just as you have your school teachers taking different subjects, you also have different kinds of food. For instance, when you eat bread in the morning, you can take rice in the afternoon and then eat potatoes at night. So, we have a variety of foods. Let us assume you ate rice for breakfast, lunch and dinner. How will you feel? You probably will get tired of eating rice. And that's why we eat different types of food daily, like beans, semo, vegetables, meat, fish, spaghetti, and so on. These foods can be categorized under different classes of food. Just like you have different prefects and subject teachers in your school. So, there are six classes of food, and they are carbohydrates, protein, minerals, fats and oil, vitamins, and water. All the six classes of food have certain functions they perform, and they target different body parts, and together, they ensure the state of overall body health, the way the prefect and teachers in your school work together to ensure law and order and making sure you understand the subjects being taught. Whenever you want to dress up for school, where do you pick your uniform? You probably pick your uniform from the wardrobe, right? And your shoes are picked up from the shoe rack and your lunchbox from the kitchen. That means all your school items are gotten from different places. How about the food we eat? The food we eat is gotten from different sources like you get your school items. Now, carbohydrate is gotten from rice, bread, yam, fufu, and so on. Protein is gotten from beans, meat, fish, and so on. Minerals is gotten from the bones of meat, fish, and chicken. For example, calcium, potassium, sodium, and iron. Fat and oil is gotten from butter, vegetable oil, avocado, and so on. Vitamins are gotten from food and early morning sunlight. For example, vitamin C is gotten from oranges. Vitamin D is gotten from early morning sunlight, etc. Water is gotten from fruits, juices, and soups. In today's class, we have learned that carbohydrates, fats and oil, vitamins, minerals, water, and protein are the six classes of food. We also learned about food, where we can get the classes of food from. Hope you enjoyed today's class. See you in the next lesson. Thank you.